been a couple days since I had any work to do, so I decided I was going to add a dump valve to the suspension. So the truck already has a dump valve, but it's this push-pull style. And push-pull just don't fit in with the vibe of the rest of my switches. Plus, the way this system works is it gets supply air to the leveling valve, then signal air for the suspension, but it sends this all the way up the frame, into the cab, then into here, then out this hose, out the cab, back the frame, and then right there into the front airbag. So when I want to dump the suspension, it's got to go through all those lines to dump the air out of the suspension, and it takes forever. So my solution is I'm going to throw a pilot valve in the system. Air will come in here, out to the airbags, but then when you apply air to this port, it blocks this port, opens this one up to this one, and just dumps the air to atmospheric pressure. It's a lot quicker and a lot more localized, so the air has less lines to travel through. But first comes everybody's favorite part, tracing lines. So I think I'm going to do is this is the one that goes to the leveling valve originally. I'm going to use this as my signal line and just tie it into one of those air switches up here to go to the pilot valve. And then this line goes to the suspension. So I am going to put a suspension gauge on the dashboard and hook this line to that. And then I'll just tee in back here and run a line from the leveling valve to the pilot valve, from the pilot valve to the suspension. Kind of like this. So supply air in, then we have air to the suspension through the pilot valve, back out of the pilot valve to the suspension, to left side and right side. And this is the line that we commandeered to run the pilot valve. That goes through all these fancy new fittings they just installed. To the switch, conveniently labeled dump valve. Oh yeah, and that other line goes to this new air gauge in the dashboard here that I robbed out of one of my other parts trucks. Kind of like I have plans for more gauges, don't you think? Anyway, it's barely registering 10 pounds because there's nothing on the suspension right now. No. Now if we flip the switch, the pilot valve opens and starts exhausting air out the bottom there. And our suspension collapses. Flip it the other way. The air starts coming back in. And we go back to ride height. Fancy. <laughs>